Can you believe that it's only been one week since Rob Kardashian's social media attack against Black China? It feels like this feud has been going on for centuries, sometimes. Unfortunately, China's had more on her plate than being a single mother of two and waging a legal battle against a member of one of the world's most famous families. Fortunately, she has a legal team to help, just as another dirtbag from her past pops up with some revealing photographs. Needless to say, Black China's attorney, Lisa Bloom, has been extremely busy for the past week. Not only has she sought a restraining order against Rob Kardashian following some pretty serious allegations of abuse. Though that alone is a big deal, Rob Kardashian is represented by Robert Shapiro. And this is making me want to re-watch American Crime Story, The People v. O.J. Simpson. But China's lawyer is also having to deal with other threats that are cropping up. You know the saying about how when it rains, it pours? In this case, the rain is ex-lovers who seem eager to release nude or otherwise sexual material of black China from during their relationship. Only a scumbag would do that, but we're not accusing black China of having the world's best taste in men. But their behavior isn't her responsibility. So, Rob Kardashian is bound by the restraining order and can't post any more revenge porn, though that was already illegal and he could very well face charges for the revenge porn that he posted to Instagram and then to Twitter on Wednesday. But remember how China was hooking up with a no-name rapper who goes by the name Ferrari? It appears that he's been trying to cash in on Black China's bad fortune by making matters worse. Specifically, he's reportedly trying to distribute intimate photos of Black China that he allegedly has in his possession. China already told Ferrari to leave her alone. Well, Black China's lawyer threatens legal action against Ferrari if he distributes any of Black China's photos. Any more, we should say, since he's allegedly posted video of Black China sleeping. In a statement about the situation, Lisa Bloom makes it clear that she is zero chill about protecting her client. We're actively and aggressively pursuing action against Ferrari. Good that they're being proactive, here. He's been publishing video of China sleeping. We're taking it very seriously. Ugh, that might mean that he was planning something like this. He's someone she dated for a little bit months ago, and he's trying to extend his 15 minutes of fame. Despicable. He's a wannabe rapper and making light of a very serious situation. We don't understand how anyone could fail to see how real this is. We've asked him to stop communicating with her. What a creep. Right now she's just concentrating on raising her kids and building her business. We're sure that she's having a rough time of it, but yeah, nobody needs distractions like revenge porn. She's not looking for love or seeing anyone seriously. We'd imagine that. Given recent events, China's had just about enough. At best, what's going on could be described as cyberbullying. But it looks worse. Here's some of what Lisa Bloom's letter had to say to Ferrari himself. We have become aware that you may have photos of Miss White unclothed or partially unclothed. That's standard for relationships, but most people don't hold them over an ex's head. We have also become aware that you may be trying to sell those photos or may try and post those photos on social media. That is just, repugnant. Posting explicit photos of Miss White on any social media or distributing those photos by any means has both civil and criminal implications for you. Surely what's starting to happen to Rob Kardashian should have already clued Ferrari into the potential consequences. Some people are just dumb and need things spelled out for them, though. This letter is notice to you that you do not have permission to post online or distribute by any means any sexually explicit photos of Miss White or her intimate body parts. It's just sad that Bloom's letter has to mention intimate body parts specifically. But, thanks to Rob Kardashian, the world's already seen Black China's vulva. Understandably. She doesn't need any other pictures circulating. 
We will not hesitate to seek all civil and criminal remedies against you if you post or distribute such photos in any manner to any person. That's intense. The moral of this story is that men are terrible and no one should trust them. Men shouldn't even trust themselves. I'm going to keep an eye on myself for just this reason. At least, that's the vibe that we get from this. It's hard to see someone see a recent lover in trouble and respond with how can I make this worse to help myself? And come away feeling good about the human race. Let's all try to be better, okay?